Alright boys, uh, today we're playing some Battlefield 4 in what I think is like one of the best game modes in this game. The only reason I'm able to play it right now is because the Naval Strike DLC is currently free. So people are actually hopping on to this uh, game mode, which is Carrier Assault. This is one of my, this is definitely my favorite game mode in this game and I think it should 100% be in Battlefield 5. Um, because oh my gosh, it's just so dynamic man. Like you can see right now we're out in the middle of uh, sort of just out in the middle of these islands here just running around but you'll see later we're, we're gonna be freaking uh we're gonna be hopping straight into the ship playing some close quarters gameplay. Dude I do not have the gun I need an AK-5C. Yeah I don't have the right gun for this man. We joined this so late but I'm just hyped dude. Oh I'm so happy I found a server on this. I've been playing the Black Ops 4 beta I already hit max rank, so I was like, okay, whatever. And uh, none of my friends were online, so I was kind of bored. So I'm like, huh, what are we going to do? And then I was like, you know what? Let's just play some freaking Battlefield 4. And I want to do a pistol-only challenge. But then I logged in, and um, I saw Carrier Assault server on my front page. And I'm like, okay, we got to freaking do this. What's up, Chopper? Oh. I'm out of here. I'm going back to our base. They armed our objective. No. Teammates, please defuse it. I'm just sending it. I'm going straight in. Oh my god, that freaking... That almost hit me. Get in, Shane. Get in. Okay. No, it got diffused, man. I mean, they blew it up. Not it got diffused. Okay, so that's the first game. Um, that one was kind of short just because we hopped in, but uh, I'll play another one of these, man, because this is so freaking fun. Drop a like down below for more Battlefield 4, and tell me if you think this should come into Battlefield 5. I 100% that this should come in some sort of DLC. Imagine this in, like, a Japanese DLC on the Pacific front. Um... This kind of game mode would be absolutely awesome. What? No! I still got a passenger seat. Darn it, boys. I thought I was definitely going to get the drivers. I was spamming it. But this game, boys, we're on Lost Islands, man. Oh, this brings back so many memories. This is my absolute favorite game mode in Battlefield 4. Oh my gosh, I am so hyped I get to play this again. Oh, this happens every time they make it free. Every year they make it free, this pops up for a little bit. And the only reason why I'm playing now when I could be playing the Black Ops 4 beta... It's just because I know I probably won't get to play this again for a very long time. It's not going to be too long that these servers are up. So I'm just, but man, I'm just going to enjoy it while it lasts. Let me hop in here maybe. Oh, can you imagine if I freaking hit that? Oh, I think I did actually hit it to be fair. Jeez. Oh, let's, I mean, we can't really drive this quad bike too far. The whole map's water. Basically, the premise of this game is... Whoever holds the more objectives, um, each objective sort of launches like missiles towards your carrier. And then as you can see the carrier health in the bottom left next to the objectives, once the carrier health is depleted, that guy just got completely turned on. Once the carrier health is depleted, then you can board the enemy's character and you have to arm MCOMs like Rush to try to blow up their carrier. It's actually a super, super cool concept. I just like because it's a really cool tug and war type gameplay. Um, at the beginning, obviously, it's just super open conquest, pretty much. Uh, but then towards the middle and end, you have to balance between defending your own objective and pushing the enemy's objective, and you have to try to, while fighting over the enemy's objective, try to manage your own freaking, like, trying to capture the objectives. Because if you haven't depleted the enemy's ship yet, then you still have to fight over the objectives while preventing the enemies from arming yours. I don't know. It's just, it's kind of hectic, but it's just super awesome. Got a hit mark on one of them. Nope, auto-aim, don't drag me. Come on. Thank you. Thank you. Uh. Run, boy! No! That guy's one shot. Ah, 
Ah, oh, whatever. Kind of want to push across. See what we can do. Swimming mechanic. I wish you could shoot in water like in Black Ops 3 and Black Ops 4, but I know that's quite unrealistic. So, <laughs> probably wouldn't work out too well with the Battlefield fans. I'm dead. 100%. Yep. <laughs> I knew it. Good effort, though. Let's go! We got the driver's seat, baby. Let's get it. Alright, this time we're playing on Ninja Strike. And, um... Yeah, man. Carrier assault again, but this time I get I actually got a boat. We got a big attack boat here. Try to go on a nice little streak with this. Okay, like, do you mind, brother? Hey brother, you drive. Drive! He's towing me now. Okay, you're chilling. Oh. How'd that not hit him? Oh, I think he uh, deployed his reactive armor. Come on. Okay, we're chilling. Got him. Okay, we got one boat already. Let's take it, isolate the second boat with our teammate. Cheese boys. Let's go. What are you getting destroyed behind us? Oh. Not quite sure what's trying to take us down. Keep driving around. What are you what's trying to shoot at me? I have absolutely no clue. Just gonna keep moving. No, I didn't reload it. That's a boof. I'm just gonna keep moving. I forgot you have to manually reload your shells. It doesn't just auto reload. Okay, that's it, that's new. Got me disabled though. Okay, I'm being a dingus. Get out of here. Yeah, okay, we're just gonna keep on the move. I'm sure how much I like this objective. You know what? Okay, that sniper's gonna try to snipe me. Oh, buddy. Kinda goofed up. <laughs> That's rough. <laughs> but he just got destroyed. Okay, what objective can I help at? I really do like this map, like the middle of this map is really awesome. Thank you. Jeez, let's go. Nice little three piece there. I think my dogs are barking. I gotta shut my door a little more. Okay, let's see. Push up to D. Or, yeah, D. You're dead, buddy. Get out of here. Come on, teammate. Get teammate. Let's go. I keep moving. Look at me jumping down from up there. We're spawning there. They gotta have like some sort of spawn beacon up. Seriously, I'm not even gonna get the capture points for that. <laughs> I was on it the whole time. I can't hit him. Just gotta flank him, I guess. I like how you still have your gun out just because the water's shallow enough. Okay. Headshot. Get me up, yo! I dropped that freaking battle pickup somewhere. I don't, I don't even care. Okay, I don't. This is just hectic. This is absolutely insane. Okay. 
it off me. I know there's a guy in front of me, but... Come on, come on, lock back on, lock back on. Okay, you destroyed, they hopped out though. Okay, let's kill this, let's go. Our carrier's breach. No, man, I'm doing my best out here. No, I'm out of ammo too. <laughs> okay, 17 and 3, man, I'm trying my hardest. Gosh, the enemy's got some good guys on their team though. I'm gonna have to go back and defend our objective though. This door's supposed to open right here. Oh, it's open. It's open. Darn it, that RGO impact just... I think it, the actual grenade hitting me killed me. Yeah, they're going to arm it right there. Darn it. Disarm it, yo. Disarm it, please. Like you can, you can get all the way up top on the carrier up there. Usually, that's where you sky down, sky dive down from. But this is, this is where it gets intense. This is the crazy part. Get out of the water, boy. Let me get out too. So it means there's gotta be an enemy. Guy behind us. Teammate, why you gotta revive him like that? There's no way he's gonna survive. He's gonna revive for 20. Just gonna hold this angle. Okay, there's so many people here. This is gonna be crazy. Okay, this is this is gonna get this last part of the game to get really intense. All right, all right, here we go. Okay, we can't board the enemy ship yet, and they already armed our objective. Well, enemy carrier's open now. Oh no, they're they just armed the they never got the first objective. What, teammates? Good job. Are you kidding me? No, sneaky defuse ain't working. They got the whole thing barricaded down. That guy's weak now. Okay, enemy destroyed our objective. You know what? I might just have to send it, boys. Yeah, see, see, this is what you do. You parachute down onto the enemy's carrier. This is so freaking dope. Let me get in behind this guy. Okay, we destroyed their objective, I guess. Now we gotta go and take the next one. Which is down below. These doors should open soon. Open up, doors, come on. Enemy engine room's open. We just gotta send it. We gotta hope our teammates disarm at once. Okay, we armed it. Okay, the enemies, our teammates have got to disarm it. And they spawn right here. Can't let them get a sneaky defuse off. No! The enemies destroyed ours before we could destroy theirs. But that's the kind of game I was talking about, man. The back and forth action on the carriers, guys. I really think that could be cool in World War II, man. Imagine a really close quarter sailor ship running around with... M1928 Thompson's just going off, man. I think that would be super, super awesome. Tell me you guys think down below in the comment section. If you are new here, don't forget to subscribe for much more action on everything in the Battlefield Universe. But again, boys, that's what it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.